Hey guys, it's Wuna here, and today we're going to be talking some SLI performance, as well as some general info about SLI and Crossfire, specifically in Bioshock. Now don't be fooled by these numbers, even though max FPS and minimum FPS is actually higher with a single card, average FPS and general stuttering performance was much better with SLI on, which is really uncommon. Usually, uh, SLI introduces a lot of uh, stuttering, but that was not the case here. The benchmarking here was done with the DX11 Ultra preset set within Bioshock Infinite. And uh, what I'm using here are my two uh, GTX 770s. These are the specifically ASUS models that I've water-cooled with NZXT uh, Kraken G10 brackets. So I do very much um, recommend using SLI here. Uh, general average FPS was 137 with SLI on and uh, 96 with SLI off, so you can get that 1440p jump if you do use SLI. And because they're water cooled, obviously, uh, I'm gonna see much lower temperatures and much higher performance because of uh, GPU Boost 2.0 uh, than you will with your air cooled cards if you happen to also have 770s. Also, this is actually an AMD game, so if you have two AMD graphics cards, go ahead and use them because the performance benefits will actually be even better than with SLI. Now, if you want to see the rest of the specifications of the computer using the benchmarking, you can check those in the description below. Anyways, guys, remember to check out our Facebook page in the description below and uh, subscribe and all that random stuff. I'll see you later.